Saya Kalasnach is the showdown player for Marseille, and I think this card looks brilliant. 84 for pace, 83 for dribbling. Shooting is okay on him as well. He's got okay passing too. 85 defending and 93 physical. He is six foot, high medium work rates, left footed, two star skills, and a three star weak foot. He's got no traits, but it's only going to cost you an 85 rated squad. He can also play at left back as well, guys, if you need that for chemistry. I thought before I actually saw 6 p.m. today, I already knew the leaks for this. I thought if he could play centre back, it's really nice with Luke Shaw, for example, who of course come or comes out as a centre back and actually can't play left back. Um, I think that'd be a nice switching game, but this card does look really, really good. As I said, an 85 rated squad only. The only issue you've really got with this card is the acceleration is a little bit low at 77. The sprint speed is good at 89. It's got good passing as well with 80 vision, 83 crossing, and 83 short passes. Agility and balance also isn't too bad. I think this card's going to be insanely good on new gen. Uh, you know, his agility and balance being at 70, 70, then his strength being at 98 means he's going to be lengthy, which is good. His reactions are good as well. His ball control is good too. His 86 dribbling is nice as well. 84 composure there too. Interception is good at 86. Defensive awareness good at 86. Same as stand tackle and slide tackle. Jumping is okay at 84. Stamina doesn't matter on centre backs. 98 for strength and aggression. It's quite easy to see what Kevin Sol you should put on him. Now, I'm kind of hoping Marseille get the win because I think this card looks better than Sola. 86 for pace if he gets the plus two. 85 for dribbling, 74 for shooting. 87 defending, 80 passing, and 95 physical guys. The Kevin Sol, as I said, is really, really easy for Kolasinac, in my opinion. It's a shallow. Every day of the week, it's going to be a shallow, guys. And the reason for that is you want to sort out the pace. More so, the acceleration and the sprint speed. The sprint speed is already really good. Goes up to 85 acceleration here, and then 97 for sprint speed. And of course, gets a really nice boost to his defensive stats as well, up to 94 interceptions, 80 head and accuracy, 90 defensive awareness, 94 for stand tackle, and then 99 for slide tackle, guys. I think this card looks insane. I'm going to play a few live games with him on new gen and old gen, so let's get into that now. For the price that he is, nice from Kalasanak there. Take your time. Oh, Ramos. Oh, Ramos, why are you not tackling there? Nice Kalasanak. Nice Kalasanak. There we go. And we're out with him as well. I really hope he's the one that gets the upgrade. Nice Kalasanak. That's really good defending there. Oh, nice Kalasanak. I thought I was doing some poor defending there, but ended up working out for me, which is nice. It's Kalasanak. He's okay at driving out as well because he's lengthy. He's going to be quite good at doing that kind of stuff that you just saw there. What a finish that is from Mbappe. God damn. Nice from Kalasnach again. He doesn't feel bad in terms of jockeying, which is quite surprising. But he plays really well. Nice start from Kalasnach there. Good tackle. All right, then, guys. Live game with Kalasnach now. Now, you're going to see, obviously, the solo review go live as well. And I'm in champs. I didn't mean to go into champs. You're going to see another highlights video from champs tomorrow. Oh, no. Oh, nice. Okay. Uh, yeah, you're going to see another highlights video from champs tomorrow, and then you'll see the rewards. I was going to do a, another video, but I thought, considering I accidentally went into champs... <laughs> I might as well just keep playing champs now. There is Kalasanach. Good pass. Oh, what a pass from Sola that is too. That's going to be 1-0 already. Let's go, man. What a finish. What a pass as well. Really good start. That is my fifth Mbappe this year as well, if you didn't, couldn't believe it. You want to go see uh, me actually packing that Mbappe for the fifth time. It's over on the, the Clips channel. I've now got a Clips channel, Vitalization Clips. Go sub to that, guys, if you wouldn't mind. That would be very nice. Go on in, Sola. Oh, I've read it. Poor. Yeah, we're here to test out Kalasanach and see what he's like. And honestly, so far, so good. He feels like an absolute menace. Got to be careful here. Oh, okay. We're against a bit of a demon. He's got red Neymar as well. Not many people are that lucky, but... Got to be on our toes here against somebody this good. Why is Messi so wide as well? I don't really understand that. Into Sola here. Into Yedda. We're going to do a step... Oh, my God. That's unlucky. Got to be so careful. I didn't think we were in champs. And that's tough. That is where Kalasan actually lets you down a little bit. Oh. Oh. Oh, my God. He is really, really slow in terms of, like, recovering. So, he's only really, like, that good on old gen if you're sitting with a low block. Otherwise, he's a little bit average in my personal experience so far, um, which is disappointing. Oh, man. I need to win this game, though. I need to focus up. We're going to go to uh, highlights from here, guys. Oh my god, what a challenge from Kalasanach that is. This guy's a really sweaty player. That is such a good challenge. 
Oh, solid as well there. It's a nice pass too. Yeah, solid passing is really solid. Really solid. And we're in again. Oh, he's moving the keeper. That was really nice from Solid there. Nice from Class Natch there. Really nice. Yeah, that's what. That, this is where he's bad, guys. This is where you are going to suffer with him. He's hard to turn in them positions as well. We've got really lucky not to concede, and that is where he will cost you. Um, if you get slid in behind, if you uh, you're, you're going to struggle with him. It's just that simple. That was nice from Kalasanac, but I'm really not enjoying him on old gen, guys. He's really not very good. Nice Kalasanac. Hold him off. Easy. Nice again, Kalasanac. Good read there. Oh, man. He struggles so much in them positions, guys. I'm getting really lucky on my goalkeeper. Kalasanac is really bad on old gen. Look how slow he is. I mean, we got lucky there. This guy's bottled that. But he is so bad, guys. Guys, I'm struggling so much with him on old gen that I'm actually summoning him out for Team Leader Virgil. I cannot stand him. He's costing me the game. He's actually costing me this game here. And we're 15 and 0 currently. So, really, really upset with this class snatch. But it's a tailor. It's, you know, it's, it's a good versus the evil. He's awful on old gen. But he is so good on new gen. So, there you go. Oh, dear. Oh, I was 15-0 in champs, guys. And then I went into a game and played with Klasnach. And he is awful on old gen. He is one of the worst centre-backs I've ever used on old gen. He is slow, lethargic, poor on the ball. Um, really has bad positioning as well. And if he gets spanning behind, you are done for. You have to play with this card on old gen on drop back. If you don't, you are going to get absolutely destroyed. Um, you know, he's an okay card on, you know, new gen. We'll go into that in a bit more detail shortly. I just wanted to cover old gen first. And if you are an old gen, you don't have a PS5 and you can't play on new gen, do not do this card. He will absolutely destroy your, your confidence as a defender. He is absolutely tragic. He felt so slow. It was crazy. Um, if you use him as left back as well, you are going to have the worst, most torrid time of your life. Oh my God, guys. I, honestly, 1 out of 10 on old gen. I think that's even being generous. I could probably go for a 0 out of 10. He was literally non-existent. Really, really bad card on uh, old gen. But on new gen, he's one of the best centre-backs on the game. So there's that. If you play on new gen, you're going to love him. Lengthy meta. He is so good. Like, honestly, so strong, so aggressive. Works really well on new gen, but literally just because he's lengthy. So apply the shallow to him on new gen, and you will enjoy him. But as I said, old gen, absolute stinker. On new gen, though, genuinely, it's probably like a 9 out of 10. That is how good he is. And I think the value for him is insane as well. 85 rated squad for a centre-back this good on new gen is just crazy. So, kind of rate him a 9 out of 10 on new gen and a 0 out of 10 on old gen. I'm not even joking, guys. Make sure you check back soon for the job review. But, guys, if you did enjoy today's video, leave a like on it, subscribe to the channel, and turn on the bell to send us a review. But, guys, that's going to be it for me for now. So, take care.